cool are those posters? They're like on wood, they're very thin, and obviously it's not real wood because it's $12, but I think they're really cool. I still like the ones at, um, at home. Yeah, the ones that at, 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 at home. <laughs> at home. They were like the square ones that had uh, silver black gold on them. Yeah, they were shiny, but really cool. They're like 18 bucks. We should go by there and see if they have them on sale. I have a coupon for 25% off there, that would I believe. Them almost so, this price. yeah, that's way better. Maybe we'll go there in another time. Um, I'll link you to that video so that you can see. It'll be right up here or there, I'm not sure. Um, but you can see what we're talking about. This is the leaked poster for the sequel to Rogue One. Shh, don't tell anyone. It's our secret. And all of the internet. In the whole internet. Target has so much cool stuff now. Like, it's not just for basic girls. It's for nerds, too. It's fun. <laughs> Gotta sip them all. <laughs> That's cool. I like that. Hmm. Fun things. So our minds are blown right now because we didn't realize that they had Caddy Heron Mean Girls pop figure. I really don't like these. I don't know why. I just am not into them. They just look too strange for me and dead in the eyes like all of the little figures. But I'm pretty excited about the Mean Girls one. I could really be into this. Also, Tony's very excited for Rose from Golden Girls. It's just... And we found... Where'd he go? Oh, Put him down here. We found more. The Niffler from Fantastic Beasts, only uh, at Target. He's kind of cute. Sophia from Golden Girls. All right, more Golden Girls happening. More um, Golden Girls. Oh. We're like digging up in here at Target, by the way. Oh my gosh. Dion. Dion, oh my gosh. Oh, Morty. That is so cool. Oh my gosh. And Morty. Found a Morty. That's so exciting. Okay, sorry for all the bad things I ever saw said about pop figures. These are really fun. Some of them. Some like, of them. Some of them are still really strange. But I'm very excited about these ones. Specifically Clueless and Meat Girls. That is so awesome. There's another row. I love it. Does it. Oh, it probably says on the back who else they make for Mean Girls. Oh, yeah. They do. They have all of them. Oh, my gosh. They, they have a Regina George. <gasps> Prayers full of secrets. Oh, my gosh. Uh, Karen and Gretchen. That is fun. Wow. That is so cool. That is so cool. What about, can you do the clueless one for me? Oh, I'm sure, I'm gonna guess it's her, the main Alicia Silverstone. Mm-hmm. Maybe Paul Rudd. And I don't know who else. Um, oh, nope. Just the three oh, of them. Amber? Amber, Come Dion, on. and about, Cher. I think, she, what about um, Brittany Murphy's character? I can't think of her name right now. Uh, Cher? No. No, I know. Gosh, why? I don't know why I'm blanking on her name, but yeah, like that should have been a great little four set. Like Amber's pretty funny, but come on, that's so funny. I'm very excited about these. I was just walking through the aisles and found me a Gretchen. That is so exciting. She's holding the burn book. How wonderful is this? This is hilarious. I'm so excited right now. We were just walking by. And I looked to the right and I saw a Cape Cod chip display. Yay, yum. So good. And they had a flavor that we haven't had in probably like a year and a half or so. Um, Two years, It's maybe. been a long time. My dad sent us a like a, a, a large bag of like 10 of them. And then we regrettably shared those with friends. Mm -hmm. And they were gone far too quickly. They almost expired. Like we yeah, held on to them so we for had a while. To share them with friends, but, but they have them in stock. Like we haven't seen this in like two years. Yeah. Uh, sweet and spicy jalapeno. They are like the perfect balance of sweet and spicy. Seriously. Like, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Yeah. And they're on Tony sale. Was like this lighthouse found them for us. Yes. It's a beacon of hope. <laughs> Yay, and they're on sale. Oh my gosh. I just saw this. This is were... awesome. Like, seriously, we've checked like every grocery store near us, yeah. all the Targets. Like, I don't know if they just got these in and that's why it's like a big display, but either way, shout out to the lighthouse. This is weird. It's like a gift card, but it's a coin. Tony's flabbergasted. <laughs> Pretty fun though. I guess you just load it up like a normal gift card. Probably don't have a coin slot for you to put it in. No, I'm sure you just scan just, the back of it you or did. something, just like a normal, yeah, just like a normal gift card, but Don't scan this one, there's fancy. nothing on it. So we're driving and Lindsay says, oh look, there's Macy's. 
And now she's cracked <laughs> up because she's like, yeah, that was the best joke. That was a really good joke. Because I was like, what, where? And she's like, ah, that was such a good joke. It was very funny. Oh, jeez. What a hoot. What a hoot. That's all. There it goes. Oh, look at the great Christmas lights. I'm just practicing for when there are actual Christmas lights. They're coming to us. Huh? <laughs> I just had the most ridiculous driving experience of my life. I'm gonna sit down and explain it to you guys later, but for now I need to start some dinner. Tony's gonna be home soon, and I imagine he is having a similar, but not nearly as crazy driving experience. Hopefully not as crazy, because mine was flipping weird. Anyways, only me. This stuff only happens to me, or someone just as fortunate as me to experience these things. Anyways, um, so I'm gonna start dinner and we're gonna eat unhealthy stuff, but we're basically just eating what is in the fridge, so I'm just gonna come up with something. There's a roll of biscuits that are gonna go bad while we're gone. We don't usually buy biscuits, but we happen to have some in our fridge, so I'm gonna use them. We also have some lunch meat and some cheese that's gonna go bad. So I'm thinking some sort of ham and cheese biscuit. And this is the sign for ham and cheese biscuit. The more you know. So dinner is ready, looks pretty good. Um, we'll see, Tony just took a bite, I took a bite. The main flavor here is butter because of the biscuits um, and that's a flavor I can get behind. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Tony says yeah. So we are going to have dinner and then um, maybe I'll tell you the crazy story.